Here's a quick overview of my room. It's not uh, completed yet, but I just want to give you an idea of how the room look. Uh, sorry about the the glare. Um, the sunlight is shining through my windows, so it's going to make my room a little bit dark. So I'm just going to give you a quick review coming in my room. Here's the back of my door. For those who know I had just purchased that, I've been storing my uh, heartfelt creation dies and stamps in there. Uh, this is uh, dealing with my receipts and my daily planning. Here's my first workstation. It's not complete. It's not fully clean, but it's okay for right now. My room could be worse. Just give me an overview. Sorry about the glare. Here's my other workstation. This is where I mainly work at. Um, scanning through the room. Here's my first setup. Store my Gemini Pro. Not my Gemini. My Gemini Go. Um, my selfie. My laminator. Then here's my large Gemini. Then that's one of my scanning cut. And these drawers uh, house all my uh, uh, cards, uh, base cards, and greeting cards I have made. Right here. Here store some of my dies, my washi tape, some die cuttings, ATC cards, my ribbons, my lace. And that cut, those are all my uh, mixed media uh uh, journal books and uh, watercolor uh, paper pads and also it this section house um, my lace ribbons um, um, what else I have tools I have some um, some fold leather leather in there and so forth don't mind that that's some junk of course this is my cart uh, stores all my uh, stamps and some dies. Those shoes holders, all my punches. I have stored my punches like this for years. Um, I just um, brought this. This house, my Cameo 3, my Cricut. My other scanning cut, you can't see because I got this table, but it got about six drawers, which holds all my um, my vinyl, the cores to the machines, instruction, and my Cricut cartridges and so forth that pertaining to this machine. Uh, in this cut, this is all my shimmers. Uh, this is my mixed media cart. Back here in this cut, got my little fridge. Uh, this little cart right here, if you could just barely see, I'm going to squeeze through it. Got all, house all my stickers. One drawer pertaining to Tim Holtz. Another drawer pertaining to all my blings. And I'm going to try to angle this because it's a tight squeeze. This cart house majority of all my dies. I might switch it out, but I don't know yet. Um, and this cut over here. It house all my um the one for uh, close to the wall that house all my hundred ten pounds eight and eight and a half by eleven paper and then further down it house um just my regular eight and a half by eleven eleven cardstock in that cut in the bag that house my easy press then this row right here. Half of it is where I have my big dies, the thick ones. And uh, further down, um, hey, how are uh, my wooden stamps? And the last drawer down here, it house my um, my paints. Sorry about this, uh, the angle of the camera. Then over here on the top, it house um, my glitter and my um, embossing powders. Also over here on this carousel too. And these two containers, plastic containers that house my uh, pipe cleaners, paper straws, cupcake liners, bowls, and so forth. Right here, of course, y'all saw my Kellex. 
So that houses all my 12x12 12 12 paper pads down below. And then I pull out some of the uh, eight and a half uh, by 11 cardstock so it'll be easy access. Then I just display some things that um, was gifted to me or what I made. It's not official how I want the top done, but I'm just storing what I have for right now. Then in this bookcase, have some things on top. Top row, have my project life. Then I have uh, my plate for my letter press and paper that goes with the uh, leather, letter press. I'm saying leather, letter press. And it has um, the three boxes right here. Those are my Boston folders in this plastic, um, I'll say it's not a Ziploc, but it's one of those um, pockets that I used to get from Michaels. It has all my tonics dies. Then I have some tonics right here. Also, sorry, shaking at the camera. My tonics right here. Then I have some um, Helen Griffin dies. Um, who else I have? I have another collection. Let me see. I have, sorry about that. I have the new collection by, uh, Sam Calcott. And what else I have? I do have, sorry guys. It's another collection I do have. And I can't, oh, there it go. And it was used to be called the our daily um bread design, but it's called something else now. So yeah, and then this house all my six by six papers, and also in the boxes I have uh paper rosettes, crepe paper rosettes, dollies, recipe cards, tags, and chipboard tags. Then here's all my cutter machines. And then my cinch. And then I'm going to go in the closet and just show y'all the outcome of I redid it. So I wanted to show you guys that too. And also hanging on the doorknobs, I have my uh, GVC uh, camcorder, my 35 millimeter uh, camera, and my Insta camera. So I'm going to be right back. And here's the outcome of my closet. So it's more organizing here. My yarn, I finally found some more space uh, storing my yarns. These two bins right here, that's yarn. Up there, these bins is uh, where I store um, cards that I had made. I got two big empty bins I just purchased. Then up here, if you can see you guys, uh, this first row is all containing, pertaining to Christmas. Then you got on top is 4th of July, then Easter. Uh, this box right here is autumn. Some more Christmas. This whole row right here is Valentine. That's Valentine. Then I have some extra containers. Uh, I have a bin for my Jane Davenport. Then these are all the holiday stamps and dies. And then these containers is pertaining to my children and my grandchildren to scrapbook. And then all the way in the cut, all the way on the top, I have some um, some bags that I use for um, crop um, to store my items um, while I go on crops. And then I have these uh, three ring binders by um, We Are Memory that I'm going to use to um, store my um already made um scrapbook page and then this big box down here i have my polymer clay oven and yes you guys i i have really organized this i like the outcome i can have easy access to everything and of course i have to label everything so i won't forget what i have or where they located so yes you guys yeah i just wanted to give y'all a tour a quick tour of my room so just see it on my Instagram if I could post it and so y'all could see the review of it thank you for watching you guys
Bye.